Well folks, this here is the number 54 car, and we're going to talk about what happened right about, yeah, right there. Right there? Yeah, you know, about here too. The car's a little broken. Now surprisingly, the 54 car had minimal, mostly, contact during the race, <laughs> at least back there. Now Billy Cable, I, this is like my first time meeting you, and yeah. we're doing this on mic, so I'm kind of excited about this. How you doing? Pretty good. How was yourself? Doing pretty good. It was a good night of racing. Not too bad. Yeah, yeah. could have been a little better, but you know. And why is that? Uh, car kind of went away on me. Kind of got a uh, little bit of damage in the beginning parts of the race. Yeah, I got stuck on the outside, used up the tires, and kind of went from there. So. Well, I think I know why you used up the tires, though. Why is that? Well, <laughs> someone definitely told you that tonight was a drifting expo for the mini stocks. That's <laughs> maybe, what I saw. Maybe yeah, it was yeah. drifting pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> trying to hold on to it so yeah now you and the 10 car daryl scoggins you got to know each other a little bit well first off what happened out during the race during the race uh actually we we're going into the, the turns i guess it's uh one and two there uh everybody kind actually of, that's five and six that's five and six oh yeah. crap road course now uh, <laughs> anyway it kind of slowed down guy in front of him kind of checked up i was letting off the gas pedal and they slammed on the brakes a little harder than i thought they were going and i ended up getting into the back of him and I didn't mean to do what I did, but, you know, it happens. And uh, after the race, he kind of let me know that he wasn't happy with me. And I was kind of waving my hand like, hey, I'm sorry, but he still ran into me. And I, after the race, I went over to apologize to him. And you know, I said, hey, everything was cool, except for what you did at the end was kind of not so cool. But, hey, I'm sorry for what happened earlier. And I you know, didn't mean to do it, but, you know. That's racing, I guess. So, I, you know, it didn't mean to take him out, yeah. <laughs> but it ended up that way. So. Well, the, the, how close the top seven cars were running in that race the entire time? I mean, it was bound someone yeah. was going to hit someone. There was a lot of action there at the beginning of the race, so it oh, was yeah. it was tight quarters, that's for sure. So, yeah. And uh, how was the conversation afterwards? Um, actually, it was just I uh, walked over there. He didn't want me in his pit, so I stood on the edge and said, "Hey, I was sorry, blah blah blah," and just kind of there was a few choice words that were said after that, but you know, I don't know. Did we he just tell you? Kind of walked away and that was it. So, did he tell you you were number one? No, he didn't actually tell me I was number one. He just told me to go away. So, maybe he told you you're number two or yeah, number three I or something. He, he's a bigger man in his car than he is in his pit. <laughs> <laughs> Billy Cable. Now, now, Billy, we've seen you out here a couple of times. Uh, how do you like driving this mini stock? Actually, I, I like it a lot. You know, Marty put a good car together. Um, everybody that's worked on it, you know, uh, got the RC race engines in there and uh pro gears helping us out damn fine car other than you know burn the tires up a little bit trying to stay up front huh. so we had fast time tonight that was good so yeah <sighs> we'll try again next time yeah i mean fastest car throughout the day but as you can see there there is a bit of damage a little bit of fixing up going on in the side let's see if we can find it again it's it's not too hard to find it's right there that's a broken car. But yeah, Billy, we always ask this to every driver we interview. Yeah. People you'd like to thank. Um, like I said, Marty, for giving me the chance to drive, you know, get up on the wheel again. I haven't driven in probably two years. Um, you know, always thank my parents. They get, they're the ones who got me into racing, so they've been doing it for over 25 years. I've been in it for over 20, so it's fun. That's about it, man. Just I have one more question for you. Here. Do people ever crack television jokes with you? Every once in a while, yeah, Cox Cable, you know, all that kind of thing. So, Kid Cable, Cable Communication, Cox Cable, whatever. Billy I'll Cable. Just do it. Billy Cable, yeah. Brake Cable, Clutch Cable. Do you, do you offer Speed Channel? Um, sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Only sometimes. All right, well, maybe I'll look into that. Uh, Pay-per-view, man. That's too much for low-budget TV. Well, Billy, thank you for the interview. All right, thank you guys for being here, man. Appreciate Bill it. Billy Cable, he appreciates it. <laughs>